Kana ni yeme no. Alright, me call them. But we can't say big up Shane say she a go on good. Alright, but now. Come to my friend, me and I. Oh, hold on, hold on, you go too fast. Good. No, let's. Alright, let's start with Sensei. I see that there was at one point. They was trying to compare you and cause problem between and, and, you and, and Celsius. Yeah, and I was really mad about it. Because what one people? What are they doing? Everybody doing good as always. What are they again with some fresh updates? You see me? We have an interview for sure on our spice. Basically, I speak our mind about Shensia and fans comparing both of them. You see me? Also, we have some more details of spice and Shensia working together. You man, people stay tuned for the details on that. And of course, we are going to talk about Shensia. New bad song with Massacre. <laughs> <Twitter and Rome. laughs> And also we have Vibes Cartel, basically you're speaking mind for the state of dance hall. You see me the dog say dance hall, I'm everything same always I go speak out and make you know what I go on, you see me. Anyway, stick around for the full details and make sure to leave a like on the video, very important. Run up the likes quick and fast to 100 likes, you see me, so YouTube can push the video to a larger audience. And if you're new to this channel, just make sure to subscribe because I don't know say yes to get the latest, you see me. So Vibes Cartel make this post for him Instagram and then basically you say your hashtag dance hall, I'm everything. Everything. So me I got to my mind whether you you like it, hate it, or even ignore it. Same so as say yo, a big artist in Jamaica has at least 500k Instagram followers and at least 500k YouTube followers. At least remember, a whole lot more, a whole lot more artists have more than that. You see me? And then basically, I say he or she whenever them release album, um, a hit between 1,500 to 3,000 copies in the first week. And then basically, I say, yo, the so called um, followers of the music or dancers, supporters, nah, buy the album or nah, support the artists, um, like how them support foreign artists and them a complain, say, yo, Afrobeat and reggaeton, I sell more than dancer. And then basically, I say, yo, it's a hypocrisy. You see me? Somebody in the comments respond and say, yes, you're right, but. Um, Third world country not really buy music like that. But whenever a stage show keep them support the stage show, the stage show them always ram. Which Vibes Cartel acknowledge say yo, I'm right upon that. You see me? But Vibes Cartel say yo, over 3 million um, or more around Canada, US and the first world country them. If them now want to support dance all them can at least support the reggae music. So reggae music can be among those top I'm selling music. You see me? Because them don't say dance hall kind of have the stigma around it. So if them don't want to support dance hall, them to support reggae music. So more of you know if you agree with Vibes Cartel and what you must say right. So and me, me totally agree. You see what I say? It's astonishing more while if you see how much views an artist can get or if you see how much persons overseas or if you see some places where the artist sang them and reach. We see some um, white people are singing the artists them song and guess what when the album them drop them not sell you see me more while me, me, me have to wonder oh you see me but yeah like what vibes cartel said support reggae music if you don't want to support dance hall i may agree with that a hundred percent but anyways people right now we're gonna move on i'm gonna check out the interview yeah we'll be used to call it resurface you see me and most people probably feel like say it's a recent interview after um a couple pages posted on instagram you see me but me i went and did the research and i saw that the video was actually posted um four years ago so i can't say i'm not going to do update but um spice was basically speaking some things you see me i said i'm gonna feel like say yo she has spit some facts since the reason why i'm gonna really share an interview from four years ago you see me but yeah really and truly she talked some things and yeah, me feel like a fox she attack. You see me, people? So, I'm going to check out a piece of the interview, yeah? And then, we we'll talk some more after, because we have some updates to go on about Spice and Shensia. Yeah? You see me? So, you say you're not going to call on So, no. So, Spice. Let's, all right. Let's start with Shensia. I see that they was, at one point, they was trying to compare you and cause problem between and, and, you and, and, and I was Yeah, and I was really mad about it because remember the days when Lady Saw was in the business as well yeah. and they did the same to me. Yeah. And I compare and I say, this and that. I'm going to like it. Yeah. And, I, and me see them do the same thing to Cardi B and Nicki Minaj. And yeah. I believe, say, the people have a lot to do with it because of them make the comments them and they make the post them and the vloggers and the vloggers and then it gets the people ego. Who better? Who this? Who this? And who that? And I don't like the comparison between female. Yeah. I believe, say, I want to do what me I do, 
and be able to leave the business peacefully and Definitely. gracefully. Yeah. And I want to do that, you know, happy and know say me do what me do. Because that is your government. Grace. Exactly. Me know they have to stay. So somebody yeah. have to come after me. Yeah. And whoever come after me, somebody are going to come after, after them. them. So I understand and know that. Yeah. So me don't want nobody to tell me about nobody I come take my place. Yeah. You can't take my place. You come create your own space. Yes. That's what I want people to understand. So, I mean, at the end of the day, when Mrs. Female just get up and I try to tear me down for reach for the top, you know, I have to be that. You know, no, me and you no can't No speed up my interview. <laughs> no speed up my interview. We where live where on the radio. Jabba, All right, so you are sensi. So you are sensi. Where are you are sensi. So you are sensi. So you are sensi are good, right? Me and Pompate are good. No, but hold on. At one point, there was a little issue with you and Pompate. There what? was never any issue Not, with me and Pompate. You're Not sure? time at all. No time at all. So reach your feelings on them. Just, I just joke. You, you know, still like, I go to the beach. Always. You know, still like, always I go to the beach. 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 You know, yeah. rich ever dirty. I want yeah. to Yeah. 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 We ever joke. Yeah. So you are rich and pompatier. So the tree, yes. tree the hard way. Good. Same way. <laughs> yes. You know, still eat roast fish and all them things together. Yes. All right. We're good with pompatier. <laughs> Well, you understand me? Yeah, because who for name you call? Right. Who for name you call? So no, 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 you have missed out one. Who that? <laughs> so, the angel. No, we don't reach this so yet, man. <laughs> Who's that? No, we don't reach this so yet. Who so, people, so Spice basically, I say, yo, she don't like the comparison thing. You see what I say? Because they did the same thing with she and Lady Sa, and she never like it. You see me? I know them do the same thing with she and Shensia, and she don't like it. Because she basically admits, yo, after her, there will be someone else. And you can see, say, she basically a kind of give a, 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 a hint, say, yo, a shensi, a forward up behind her. You see me? Yeah. So it's not about taking her place or taking over from her. It's basically come in the space and do your own thing. You see what I say? And do the good work, said we. And you have to agree with Spice. And when him talk like that, you see me? So more of you know, thoughts on this are still. But remember, I say, it's not a recent interview. So. We don't know, get too hype in the comment section, you see me? But anyways, people, um, on a futuristic note now, so Shenzian Spice is um, scheduled to host for Zeus, and then basically I hunt some Caribbean bodies, you see me? I don't know what that means. But Zeus is basically a show similar to Love and Hip Hop, like a Spice Stepan. And we don't know why Zeus chose Shenzian Spice at the same time, but remember I said them show there's a drama show, I mean, I don't know if them are hopes that drama go go on. You see me? But we keep on posted upon that. But, yeah. Two of them are going to work together upon the show, people. So, it's a good look. And we don't know the, the relationship between them at the moment. The last time, you know, say, they never good. But hopefully, throughout the years, they probably can send each other one of you text message or encourage each other. We don't know what's going to be on the scene, so... I don't know what to think about. This is going on the update as always. You see me? Yeah, and another update. Shensia Jaffa wrote a piece of song. The song is actually now over a million streams in less than 24 hours. But too hours. young for lockdown with nobody. I pray one day. Hit and Run is really a hit, people. You see what I say? Really a hit. And the mere fact that she dropped uh, Massacre upon it does make it more special. You see what I say? And I don't know, say, Massacre of yard away right now massacre of the streets you see me so if we make mix shensi we basically a sing and kind of bring that lover vibe there and then you have the gangster vibe mixed with it it's a different kind of touch of that you see me and massacre as no no i got rough up theme verse i guess i who produce it now the no, no, genius man you see me one steven yo that song i did after it you see me? And Steve himself even did forward upon the fix and say, yo, that him find the formula. All him years are producing, him actually just find the formula. And every song we got drop in 2024, I got hit. That him say what I'm on. So right now, Shensia basically win over about the haters them kind of don't know say she been a get it hard. You see me? <laughs> hard yo but yeah but just one song win them over you see me but so as i go with music you see me i say most of the time i'm bash your shins here and i really because them want bash you because them hate you because them know say you have the potential for do a whole of greatness it's just that the music where you've been a job since you go america them just never did a feel it you see me but see you find it yeah with just one song 
So imagine if you did a thing like this and I give them the yard style. Because basically with a song you mix you mix it, you know. So you see if you just continue and mix it like this, tell me I tell you. You have yard and a broad lock. You see me? But people wanna feel about the song. Definitely want for you to touch on this in the comment section. Anyways, that are that for the video today. Leave a like. You see me? I say run up the video. Run up the likes on the video quick and fast. To 100 likes. You see me? So YouTube can push the video to a larger audience. You see me? And leave your thoughts and opinion in the comment section as always. You see me? I'm out.